So I am tentatively hopeful for what regressive has. And I'm hoping I'm saying that right because I think it's regressive. I know there it was progressive and some other aggressive. Or something is at the very least. Okay, actual fight. There were five there. I'm only putting two. Okay. This works out. Because. Yay! I'm glad I kept Trace on because she has a similar weapon. Actually, works out really well for me. Heal wounds because Therian is low. Oh, you're healing way more. I can't remember. Did I get her to that level before? I honestly can't remember what I left Ophelia at. Because I'm curious as to if she and anyone else who are not in the party are getting some sort of experience. It's helpful if that answer is yes. Because otherwise it's going to be a way harder time grinding in the future. Yeah. I figured it may not be the end end all so but I got close enough to the level that I can just move through this I'm not gonna be too concerned about running in circles I will get all the freaking chests that I can though it's hopefully money I think that's the biggest thing in this game is I am freaking broke everywhere. Oh, my only reason Miss Cyrus is freaking let me know what these things as are weak to. I hate the guessing game is kind of fun, but it's also nice to know as soon as you go into a fight. Oh, this will work. Yes. A few times. Good job, Ophelia. You're doing decent damage. Your things more powerful. There we go. But some other anime I want to talk about is, I know I've talked about some of the season, current season anime that I've been watching, Banana Fish, Honey Bado, um, those are the two that stand out that I think I've talked about. Um, so doing something with those, I may do like a just season breakdown of what I thought about the list of shows that I actually watched. I'm not going to get into anyone I didn't watch. Certainly nothing against those that I didn't watch. I usually, even some of the ones that I have been watching, I'm not going to watch to the end. I'm going to try to with most of them, but at the same time, my patience for some things can wear thin. 
and honey bottom is one that's sort of wearing thin on me so I want to get a little bit further kind of the same time my energy and maybe end of season where I'm finally like okay let me catch up and watch a bunch of episodes and maybe watch till the very end because all the end all of it has come out now so Sizzle work is another one, which I actually, Sizzle work is interesting because I talked to my grandmother about that one, and she's not into anime at all. Like, I am the odd one out in my entire family of, I like all these geeky, nerdy things, like video games, and anime, and cartoons, and whatever it is. I'm all in on it. Yeah. So... I am sort of the only one in my family that has this sort of interest. And I was telling her about that one and she's like, that sounds interesting. And I'm just like, okay, this is something that if I were to show it to you, you'd actually probably enjoy on some level. Because the concept is interesting and open enough of, and cute enough that anyone who watches it can probably find some entertainment value out of it. So, if that does get a dub eventually, I may bring it next time I visit or something, watch it with them, or even watch it with my aunt or something, say, hey, let me show you this. I know it's not your normal style, I know it's not what you normally watch, but this is just fun bullshit. I actually need to sit down with my aunt and probably say, hey, let's watch Game of Thrones together. Because they want to get into it. I've already gotten into it. Watched the show. Read mold, most of the books. I'm still like halfway through the fifth book. And I'll be honest, I skimmed most of the first and second book. Just because a lot of it is same to what happened in the show so I was like okay let me skim this section and I normally like I would pause stop okay this didn't happen in the show let me read more into it or this did happen in the show I want to see the books take on it a little bit more so things like that I stopped for but and yeah I'm talking about Game of Thrones while the story's going on I don't These guys know who he actually is. At least that Gaston guy may know he is. Potentially.
Okay, so he doesn't know. But he has the flame. Oh, that's a so cool. I still feel it's weird when the giant boss enemies are human and so freaking large, but at the same time, that's a cool design. I like that. Very Viking. Okay. But at the same time, you were supposed to be weak to that. Everyone else has been weak to that, and damn it, you're not weak to that either. Okay, let's see how holy that is. Nothing. Okay. He is not weak to sword slashes. Motherfuck. So it's gonna be porn. No, you're not. Thank God. Yeah, you're not doing that. Not a fan. God damn it, Ophelia, heal. Where heal was there we go. Good job, Ophelia. All you need to do. Okay. Oberyn just a self boost, which is fine. Elemental defense isn't really gonna help us, so I'm gonna summon. Because I still have six summons left on this dude, and he can do some damage. And holy crap! He's the best summon I have. And trade wins will be great. Break him. It's one less thing to worry about. Asshole. Damn it. Damn it. Can one of them just die at the very least? Be super helpful. Good lord.
Thank you for being super helpful. Definitely need more SP before this is over. I'll be calling you back soon, Tavern Patron. Dolphus. Wind Dolphus. That's helpful. I really utilize the items in any way. Trade winds. I just enjoy that move on so many levels. Summon. Because it's super helpful right now. think of friggin' Beauty and the Beast. No, you don't. Don't do that. You're not allowed to do that kind of crap. Um, uh, luminescence. Actually, wait to staff. That's good to know. Hit that move. slightly concerned in this fight because I'm not sure how well I'm doing. I don't think I'm doing well with it. Ow. Give her him because I definitely don't want him hitting after that. Die. Seriously, just die. Go away, dude. Okay. I don't really want to use him up, up. And I really miss Hannah right about now. Actually, really, I miss Linden. <laughs> or Linda. Okay. 
one down. This. And Teresa. No, I have four. Okay, so already in yellow, which is good. I feel like it hits for shit, but technically, she's not here today. She's here to heal. Let's do this. Nice part everybody realize about also summoning the patron or any other summon is they can potentially attack while she still does healing so you're not losing out on no damage is being done no one's getting hit during her turn it's no she can do healing while they do some damage and potentially break some people I'm actually gonna need this. Break with Ophelia. I feel like that's more of an insult than anything. And now you can heal. 